Are you in the market for a new tumble dryer but you're just not sure which one to choose? Well in this video we're going to talk you through the three main types of tumble dryer and they are a vented condenser and heat pump. We'll run through the pros and cons and we'll see if we can decide which one will best suit your needs. So first up, let's talk about vented tumble dryers. Now they are the most traditional type of tumble dryer and they work by using electric heating element to generate hot air which is then circulated through the drum containing the wet clothing. The hot moist air is then vented outside through a hose and the dry heated air is circulated back through the drum to continue the drying process. One main advantage of vented tumble dryers is that they tend to be relatively inexpensive to purchase. However, they do have some downsides. For one, they can be noisy as the hot air and moisture need to be vented outside. Additionally, they can be less energy efficient than other types of tumble dryers as they use more energy to generate heat directly. And finally, they require a vent hose to be installed in order to function properly, which may not be practical or possible in all homes. Next, let's talk about the condenser tumble dryers. These work in a similar way to vented tumble dryers, but instead of venting the hot moist air outside, they cool and condense it back into water, which is collected in a reservoir or drained away through a hose, which means the condenser tumble dryer doesn't require a vent to be installed, which makes them a good option for homes without an external venting option. One of the main benefits of a condenser tumble dryer is the convenience and ease of installation. However, they can be more expensive to purchase than vented tumble dryers, and they may not be as energy efficient as they still use an electric heating element to generate heat. Additionally, the water reservoir or drain hose may need to be emptied regularly depending on how frequently you use the dryer. Finally, let's look at heat pump tumble dryers. These use a heat pump to circulate hot air through the drum containing the wet clothing rather than an electric heating element. The heat pump works by using a refrigerant to absorb heat from the air and then releasing it inside the drum to dry the clothes. This process is more energy efficient than using a traditional electric heating element because it uses less energy to move heat from the air to the drum rather than generating it directly. Heat pump tumble dryers tend to be the most energy efficient type of tumble dryer as they use less energy to dry clothes. However, they can be more expensive to purchase rather than vented or condenser tumble dryers. They also tend to have a longer drying time as the heat pump needs to circulate the hot air more slowly to be effective. Another point to mention on the heat pump tumble dryer, they don't actually get as hot as the vented or the condenser, which actually helps bring that energy efficiency down and it recycles that hot air. So budget, as I've kind of touched on through this video, will always be a factor. If you haven't got a lot of money to spend on a tumble dryer, then the vented one will be a lot cheaper. However, the monthly cost will be more expensive. So it's getting that balance right between how much you can afford now to how much you want your electricity bill to be. So this also depends on how much you actually use the tumble dryer. If you only use it a couple of times a week or even a couple of times a month, then you can go for the more cheaper one. However, if you're gonna use it every day, a couple of times a day, the heat pump is a good investment. Now, I am gonna do another video shortly on how much money you'd save if you had a heat pump tumble dryer over the condenser or the vented. So if you haven't done so already, please do subscribe to this YouTube channel. Consider your laundry needs. If you've got a large family and you need to dry clothes regularly and fast, the heat pump tumble dryer may not be the best option as it takes a lot longer. Yes, it will save you money, but do you need things done quickly? If you need them done quick, the vented or the condenser will do it in a much faster time than the heat pump. By bringing you any value, please do like this video and subscribe to the YouTube channel. So to summarize, vented tumble dryers are the most affordable, but they are their least energy efficient. Condenser dryers are more energy efficient than the vented and they are easier to install and they can pretty much go anywhere as long as they're not in a cold environment, but they are more expensive to buy and maintain. The heat pump tumble dryer are the most energy efficient. You can put them pretty much anywhere, not in the cold rooms, but they are more expensive to buy in the first place. And they'll take longer to actually dry your clothes. So if energy efficiency is your top priority, you have to go for a heat pump. They're gonna keep the monthly bills a lot lower than the condenser and especially the vented. However, they will take longer to actually dry your clothes and the initial cost is a lot more expensive than the condenser or the vented. 